Hi, I'm Danny, and welcome to my channel. For today's video, I have my finale to the That's Expensive Project Pan. This is a Pantastic Ladies collab that was created by Misty, and I have all of that information linked down below. This started last year on December 28th, and the finale is today. We were to choose eight to 10 of our most expensive products and work on them in this project. For the last update, I finished two items, so I decided not to roll anything new in since there was just one month left of this project. So I am down to the final six products that I have been working on. So let's jump right on into my progress. The first one that I was working on was my MAC Spellbinder Shadow in the shade Swing on a Star. As of the last update, I had used this 255 times. Over the past month, I have used it 17 more and I have finally finished this eyeshadow. It is completely gone, and I'm so happy that I have one of these done in my collection. I think the value of these was $25. I have the prices all listed in my description box, but I have an eyeshadow finished. I am super excited about that. 272 uses to finish using this eyeshadow. Next, I was working on my Charlotte Tilbury Matte Revolution Lipstick in the shade Bond Girl. As of the last update, I had used it 125 times to get down to here. Over this past month, I have used it 62 more times, and this is it rolled all the way up. So as you can see, I am almost completely down to the plastic. If I roll it down to the top of the plastic, I have the tiniest bit left. I am filming this a little bit early because Christmas is coming up and I want to be able to take a few days off and spend time with my family. So rest assured, this will be completely level with the plastic. You will see this in my empties coming up, but 187 uses on this. I can give you a swatch. This is a shade right here. I am wearing it on my lips today. It's a beautiful formula and I'm happy that I have finished off a lippy this year. Next, I was working on my Biro Bitter Green Essence Toner. As of the last update, I had used it 141 times to get down to here. I've used it 42 more times and I am right here. So I didn't finish this. I thought maybe there was a chance, but there's no way I can have this finished. I got 183 uses from brand new down to here. So this one will probably be finished maybe February of next year. Next, I have my Avant Micellar Water. This is my absolute favorite. As of the last update, I had used it 60 times to get down to here. I've used it 22 more and I am right there. So I have probably about a month's worth of uses left in here. So I've gotten 82 uses on this one. So one more month to go. Next, I was working on my QMS Meta Cosmetics Active Glow Tinted Day Cream. As of the last update, I had used this a total of 32 times. I've used it 21 more, and I think I'm down to here. So I still have a ways to go. This is the widest part of the container. I've gotten 53 uses out of this. It is very light. It is very sheer. I do have to use a couple pumps of this every time I put the foundation on. So... It does go a little bit quicker than a typical standard foundation. I think maybe a month or two more and this one would be gone. The final product I have is my Sunday Riley Good Jeans All-in-One Lactic Acid Treatment. As of the last update, I had used this 10 times and I have not used this over the past month. I have not reached for it. I have been preferring more gentle exfoliants, a physical exfoliant where I can control how abrasive it is. With my skin issues and everything that I've had going on, I didn't want to reach for this at all. So 10 uses and I am still right there as you can see in the packaging. So I was able to finish two more items. So let's go over some numbers for this project as a whole. Since December 28th of last year, I was able to work on 20 products. I finished 15 and I hit one goal. I only had one goal. The goal for all of the other 19 products was to finish. So I finished 15 and the value of that was $950.17. So I was able to get through some very expensive products in this project. So I'm really happy about that. And yeah, I feel like I had a really successful year doing this project. I think that is everything that I have to share with you. Before you go, if you haven't, I hope that you'll please subscribe to my channel and ring that bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Thank you so much for stopping by. Mm -hmm.